Welcome to British Biomedicine Institute. Today we will explore dual energy, computed tomography, D, E, C, T, and radio diagnosis. Dual energy CT, also known as spectral CT, is a computed tomography technique that uses two separate X-ray photon energy spectra, allowing the interrogation of materials that have different attenuation properties at different energies. Dual Energy Computed Tomography DECT, is an emerging imaging technique that combines information collected with various X-ray energy fields. Whereas conventional single energy CT produces a single image set, dual energy data attenuation values up to energy spectra can be used to reconstruct numerous image types. Weighted Average Images Virtual Monoenergetic Images Material Decomposition Image S. Electron Density Maps Effective Atomic Number Maps In the abdomen and pelvis, dual energy CT may be used in the liver to increase conspicuity of hypervascular lesions in the kidneys to distinguish hypertenuating cysts from enhancing renal masses and to characterize renal stone composition in the adrenal glands to characterize adrenal nodules and in the pancreas to differentiate between normal and abnormal parenchyma. Dual energy CT provides information about how substances behave at different energies, the ability to generate virtual unenhanced data sets and improve detection of iodine containing substances on low energy images. Knowing how a substance behaves at two different energies can provide information about tissue composition beyond that obtainable with single energy techniques. The term K-edge refers to the spike in attenuation that occurs at energy levels just greater than that of the K-shell binding because of the increased photoelectric absorption at these energy levels. The lower energy level of depth acquisition, typically 80 kVp, improves contrast to noise ratio, CNR, because the average photon energy is closer to the K edge of iodine, 33.2 kiloelectron volts, compared to a single energy polychromatic beam of 120 kVp. K edge values vary for each element, and they increase as the atomic number increases. The energy dependence of the photoelectric effect and the variability of K edges form the basis of dual energy techniques, which may be used to detect substances such as iodine, calcium, and uric acid crystals. Manufacturers continue e, to improve dual energy CT scanners, and those that are currently available differ in terms of the number of X ray tubes, the number and arrangement of detector arrays the energy of fan beams, and the rotation of X-ray tube, S and detector arrays. Dual Energy Computed Tomography, DECT, produces accurate anatomy, C and functional photos by manipulating the differences in the interactions of high and low energy photon spectra with various materials and tissues atomic factors to accurately discriminate the chemistry of tissues of the body as well as disease processes. Improved lesion detection and characterization by DECT could potentially reduce the need for short interval follow-up studies, decrease the number of unnecessary biopsies, and improve screening for hypervascular liver tumors in cirrhotic patients. Dual Energy CT offers exciting applications and possibilities previously unavailable with conventional single energy CT. The potential benefits of including increased lesion, detection and characterization, improved oncologic staging, and evaluation of treatment response, and reduced artifacts, all at comparable or even reduced radiation doses. Thank you for showing interest in British Biomedicine Institute Skilled Nano Degree Program. Hope you have gained a lot of clinical information through this presentation. Please share, like, and subscribe. British Biomedicine Institute channel, good luck.